King Kridrevskoy, the mighty ruler of the Netherworld. His long reign came to an abrupt end as the news of his death spread throughout the Dark Land. Ambitious demons rose one after another to seize the opportunity. And thus began the age of turbulence and anarchy. Two years later, Only one thing left to do. What fool dares awaken me, the great Laharl? Whoops. Did I kill him? Oh well, what can I say? Looks like I'll just have to take on the prince's legacy myself. The title of Overlord! <laughs> for you, dude! Would he normally die from that? The Overlord's son should be able to deflect a couple hundred rounds, no problem. Master Etna, you don't look very happy, dude! 
What are you talking about? I'm glad that Brett's finally dead. In fact, I've never been happier. I bet, dude! He'd boss us around, but he couldn't even figure out how to set the VCR! The fan is stiff and my food is bland! His complaining sure was annoying, dude! It's his own fault for being betrayed by Master Etna, dude! Yep, it's his fault for dying so easily. But this isn't good. What's the problem, dude? Mission accomplished, right? But that is the problem. Think about it. With the prince gone, he's got no use for me. I just know he's gonna betray me. You're too cynical, dude. I think you're gonna get a huge reward. Don't be stupid. That'll never happen. Why not? You did your job, dude. Because if I was him, I'd betray him as me. You demons are evil, dude. But the prince is dead, dude. Won't he find out eventually? I suppose. Oh, I know. <laughs> you there, you cute little granny. Come over here, yeah. I have a bad feeling about this, dude. I said get over here. Coming, dude. So what's the plan, dude? Well, only... From now on, you're Prince Laharl. Dude! You just stuck an antenna on me, dude! Don't worry about it. You look just like the prince. No one will know. Where do you get all of that confidence, dude? <gasps> hey, look over there! Ah! Ah! See? You fooled that monster. You really should trust me more. Oh, yeah. All these guys want to be the Overlord, so you might want to watch your back. Are you serious? Master Edna, please help me, dude! What are you talking about, Prince? Wouldn't you rather wipe out these losers with your magnificent powers? You guys are my friends, right, dude? We believe in you, Prince, dude! Dude! expecting that, but at least everybody knows the prince is still alive. <laughs> but won't that make more demons try to kill us, dude? Don't worry. Our mighty Prince Laharl here will crush those fools. But what about demon lords? We can't beat them, dude. Ooh, they'll make perfect examples to show off the prince's power. In fact, I don't even want to wait for those demons to show up. That could be me next. I hope Prince Laharl is up to it, dude! Well, let's just go back to the castle and celebrate the prince's return! All right, dude! Ah, oh, my back! I can't believe no one's noticed what's going on, dude! Everybody always hated the prince, so maybe they just don't care! Are you joking? You don't know how much I spent to keep their traps shut. I didn't even notice you were bribing everybody, dude! Oh, and by the way, I paid everybody with your paycheck. You're evil, dude! Reporting in, Master Etna! A new demon named Fires is rapidly gaining popularity, dude! Many demons are joining forces with him, dude! Never heard of him. Leave him be. He's probably just a nobody. He's after the throne! We gotta deal with him eventually, dude! Ugh! This overlord business is such a pain in the ass. If you don't take him out, he might eat all that food! 
pudding from the Sea of Gehenna that you've been hiding in the fridge, dude! What? Ooh, if anyone touches my snacks, they're dead! Wait, how do you know about my stash? I'm just saying what if, dude! I don't know anything about it! Fine. So, where can we find this demon? Just ask the gatekeeper to take you to Byers Castle, dude! Well, Prince, it's time to stretch your stuff. What are you waiting for? Let's go already! Good God, dude! Here goes. Here goes. in a nice place. Prick. Be careful, dude! We came through the main entrance and no one's appeared yet! You're right. It almost seems like he's... Not home? So, you made me come all this way for nothing? That's it! I've gotta... break something! Dude, he should be here! I've done the research, dude! Right now, Fire should be staring into his mirror, asking who's the most of them all, dude! Ugh, what a freak! Yeah, he was voted most likely to earn a degrading name in the Pretty Times, dude! So, he's in his room? I've done the research, dude! All right, you know what to do! Standard Pretty Looting Formation! Let's move it! Roger that, dude!
everything that's valuable. <laughs> Master Etna, did you hear that? <laughs> what? You're just hearing things. <laughs> He's choking, dude! How rude! You should never ignore a gentleman. What is it now? Kind of busy here? That is hardly a proper reaction after pilfering Moi's treasure. But I give you credit for your bravery. <laughs> My name is Vyers. I am the lord of this castle. Finally? So you're Vyers. <laughs> what is it now, you freak? I cannot help it. It seems when people call Moi that name, I get this... Overwhelming sensation. Oh, it brings such tears to my eyes. Uh, looks like the rumors were right. You are a freak. My dear, I am an aristocrat blessed with beauty and power. They call moi the Dark Adonis. Now, mademoiselle, you are no ordinary thief. Am moi right? Yeah, well, you're no ordinary spaz. I admit it. I came here to eliminate you. Ah, I see. But, mademoiselle, you cannot defeat moi. Yeah, that's what they all say. But too bad for you. I'm not your opponent today. <laughs> then who wishes to face moi? Beg for mercy! You face the son of King Krachevskoy, Prince Laharl! <laughs> nice to meet you! I'm Prince Laharl, dude! <laughs> Your attempts at humor don't go over well with nobles, such as myself. You think this is a joke? What's the problem? <laughs> I'm Prince Laharl, dude! You, sir, are a prinny. You idiot! Look closer! Don't you see the antenna? <laughs> well, Laharl did have those. See? That proves he's the prince. You would have moi believe he is the prince simply because he has antennae? What more could you possibly want? Laharl is Krachevskoy's son, is he not? Shouldn't he have something more? His father's noble and sparkling good looks, for example? Yeah, right. If he was anything like his father, I wouldn't have killed him. Huh? Oh, uh... Anyways, this is the prince. It doesn't matter what you say. Wait, w w what happened to, uh... Ugh, just kill him. Go, pretty, uh, prince. Master Etna, this ain't gonna work.
Italia. He is the prince. I see. Beautiful mademoiselle, does your conscience not ache? Nope, not at all. Yeah, dude, nothing can hurt Master Edna's dark conscience. <laughs> Why should I feel bad about defeating you anyway? That is not what I meant. Do you have no regard for the wishes of your master? Have you no loyalties to anyone? Hey, you're a demon too. Betrayal is a part of what we do. Besides, I pledged my loyalty to King Krzyzewskoy, not the prince. Do you believe King Krzyzewskoy would be proud of you were he standing before you now? What? King Krzyzewskoy is dead. Hmm? Now I'm going to decide how I'm going to live my life. I'm sure King Krzyzewskoy would understand. Let's go, pretties! Looks like we've had a change of plans. What will he do now? Yes, he just woke up. But his powers are still there. In fact, he just crushed the new up-and-coming demon by brute force. I see. But still, how did he survive after drinking that potion? And he has gained so much power. This is not good. Don't worry about it. Leave everything to me and the crown will be yours. Are you certain? Of course. Just remember. I know. When I reign as the Overlord, I will give you what you want. <laughs> it's time for Etna's Q&A Corner! This isn't the next episode preview! I'm taking this time out of my busy schedule to answer all your letters! This has got to be a scam, dude! Let's check out the first letter. It's from a seven-year-old boy from Earth. Now, let's see. Help me! I'm always being picked on at school. Sounds pretty serious, dude. Are you sure you can handle it? Please, they're little kids. I can massacre her like a billion little bullies. Wow, dude! Master Etna, you're willing to help him out? Sure! And I'll do it for the amazingly low price of 500 million health. What? No kid can afford that, dude! All they have to do is ask their mom or dad. But no one has that kind of dough, dude! Well, I'm not running a charity here. So you're not gonna do anything? You're horrible, dude! Fine, he doesn't have to pay now. After he dies and becomes a printy, I'll just make him work it off. Don't do it, dude! 20 hour work days are hell! Run away while you still can, dude! If you really want my help, send me another letter. You don't even get paid, dude! You hardly get fed, too! Don't even think about it! Okay, you keep on talking and I'll toss you out again. Stand up to bullies, dude! 